Hi, Rainbow. Hi, Rainbow. We are on, still on the road. We are on the move. No, we're not. We're eating. <laughs> well, technically, you're moving though. We mm. got, we got, see, all the bags, and we carry them for one kilometer. Yes, to the bus stop. Now we are waiting at another bus stop. That's not our bus though. For a double decker uh -huh. bus. Double decker bus, a marine plane. Rainbow had to take a break, so Rainbow is at the hospital right now. We are yeah. moving on. She's at the spa. She's at the spa. Yeah, she's going to the doctor and then she's going to the spa. We had to put the cast in both back wheels. Instead of just sitting here, we had already some other things planned and we just found an alternative way of getting there, which is by bus. Uh -huh. So Five hours. Yeah, five hours in bu the bus to go to Copenhagen. What country, Emma? Guys, so we're gonna pause the video right now if you want to guess. Write in the comments right now if you know where Copenhagen is in the world, okay? And say, Cosmo, I know where that is in the world, okay? Three, two, one. Emma, say it. Where are we going? We're going to Danish land. We're going to Denmark. <laughs> so we'll show you our little trip on our five hour bus. Massa there, Cosimo and Luca there. You know, you think airplanes are small. This is small. It's small, but we are on a double decker. <laughs> so Luca's so happy because we are on the top floor of the double decker. I'm not sure if we have to get down, but we're getting in line. I was like, oh my gosh, this place looks like a mall. And I was like, if you didn't see the outside, it would look like you're just in a building. Yeah. And it's moving. It doesn't even feel like it's moving. Well, I mean, trust me, if you walk, you're gonna be like, whoa. missed a huge thing the bus almost exploded but luckily i was there and i stopped the bomb from detonating you are a hero yeah cosimo it's our hero guys you missed it all so subscribe if you want to see the full video of that so we now have 20 more minutes or more to get to our airbnb so let's walk <laughs> let's walk again Five world explorers and doing something fun today. Yep, First day of exploring Copenhagen, we decided to make it a fun day. <laughs> Instead of doing the touristy thingies, we are going to a museum, the Experimentarium. It's all about hands-on science. Cool thing that we learned is that the best way to go around Copenhagen <laughs> is by using the Copenhagen card. So with this Whoa. card, you get a bunch of attractions included, the bus rides, metro, some of the boats that go on the canals. If you start summing everything up together, it's cheaper to get the card for a certain amount of days than to try to buy every single thing, especially when you're a family of five. So today we got our bus ride, which was long, and then we get to go to the museum and then who knows what else we're gonna do, which is included in our card. Keep going forward. After a little bit. Hey, I think we found it. This should be it. Wait, this is the movies. No, move more forward. Wait, here? 
First floor is dedicated to the fact that Denmark exports and imports from everywhere in the world. And this is an example of all the products being sent from and back from Denmark to Asia. Kids can uh, go in every part. There's different tasks that they can do. From there, they can work their way to send out these shipments of products. Here it shows you how the banana travels from Costa Rica, wherever it was, all the way to China. And here you have all the little shipping containers. Here is Cosimo getting really busy exporting from Singapore. Yep, I am. People are putting way too many blue balls here. They have to all go back to where they came from, okay? This is the fun one, Mama. So now they're going. They go this way, this one's going here. One over here. It goes up, see? And it takes the plane way all the way back to where it came are. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah? Here goes another one. I'm trying to send all the blue balls. See, look at that! Someone keeps sending blue balls over here! Probably your little brother. Yeah. <laughs> Loka! How'd you get up there? Secret. It's showing you how the stuff doesn't fall off, also if the wind is getting stronger. No, we're going even more? Now the game starts focus. If you are more focused and relaxed, oh. So the ball has to go. If you're more focused, it comes towards you. Yeah. Emma, stop focusing. Okay, I'm just gonna turn away, Emma. Now you focus. Luca, is that your heart? Yeah. Oh no, Luca! Oh wow, are you gonna put the body back in, everything back in? Yeah. Oh my god, the heart feels so weird. You have to find where the art stays. The heart goes here, Luca. Look. If you go fast, he will lose his balance. Okay. Can't get him off this. He's too Why heavy. Go? Ready? Yeah. Oh. And we gotta be in sync. You pull. It looks like a lot of water. Luca, oh, yeah. what are you doing? Oh, I wanna do it. Grab a duck! It's a duck race! Okay. And one of them is the finish line. And they have to make it to the hole. That's what they have to do. What? Three, two, one, go! Oh, so I'm a pink. I think you can help yourself with these thingies. Oh! Hey, don't close it! Oh my god, mine's gonna win! Wait, how is yours winning? I don't know! Oh, it's taking a shortcut! What? I'm just winning. There goes mine! Cause mine's just back there! <laughs> yes! I'm gonna win! Oh, I'm gonna win! I won! Oh, come on! I'm gonna win! Hey! I'm gonna win! I have to get in there! So it's gonna be really hard! It's gonna take forever for me! Oh, oh yeah, me and Mom are coming. Oh! Hey, look at that. I'm sorry. 
Well, I'm going to turn closer. Woohoo! Okay, I don't think they're meant to go in the middle. Yes. Okay, your poor duck is still out there. Yes, they are, buddy. Come on! Who's going to win? Oh, oh, mine's going to win! Mine's going to win! Mine is winning! Uh, oh! Oh! I got third wait, place! Wait, what? <laughs> I thought I was going to win! Whoa, third place! And here I am, all okay. sad in the floor. Okay. Oh, that's so cool. And then we make the way to go this way. This is awesome. I think it's so good to over here just uh, blue and red. Over here is green and red. And over there is blue. Guys, this is a colorless room, but when you press point the light, you get color. And then this one is orange. So you have to race ah. with the robot. Ah. Ha! It was me! <laughs> Emma was faster. Oh, yeah. Emma's trying to drive her first car, yeah, but, but she crashed it in the wall already. I did? Well, yeah. Did you see the car? There's a human! Ah! Okay, I didn't crash yet. It's dark. No, it Why are you not on the road? Ah! Who's that? Why are they calling me now? Maybe you should answer. Ah! Excuse me. Did you remember to invite Aunt Charlotte to your birthday? No. No, 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 no. It's really important. I don't don't care. you remember how insulted she became last year? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. This is a black dog <laughs> and a black bun. Here, Cosimo, your lunch. Mm. It tastes the same, though. Mm. That is really weird. It's black. Something Bert, you eat here in Denver. Black, black. Bert, so we spent the past five and a half hours I mean, yep. in the experimentarium. Yes. I personally really enjoyed it. What about you, Cosimo? Oh, Cousy? spider. Oh. What about you, Cosimo? <laughs> Oh, that was, that was a weird noise. Uh, I really liked it. It was, it, I didn't, it didn't even feel like five hours. I could have stayed there for years. Mom, what did you think of the Science Museum? It was super cool. I'm so happy we did it. It was so interesting, interactive. I feel like you've never been as entertained as today. <laughs> and I, I just, the city has so much to offer to anybody. People alone, young people, elderly people, kids, families, blah, 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 everybody. There's something for everybody, so. What did you think? Did you like it? No. Excuse me. You loved it. You didn't want to leave. Luca's favorite part was the boats. He kept making them go up and down the locks, right? Yeah. Ah. 
Yeah. But now we're sad because it's finished. Yeah. We stayed till the end of it. So the very end. This is a very great way to start. So if you are a family with kids, or I guess if you're even just two adults, you should totally yes, come here come because it's so much fun for everyone. <laughs> okay, Luca, what do you have to say? <laughs> Okay, so as Luca was trying to say, but failed desperately, guys, you better be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow on Facebook, and Instagram, and YouTube, and TikTok, and all those places. Okay, bye! Go to a science museum somewhere! <laughs> and we're starting with the most famous thing to see, which is the Little Mermaid. And the somethingly altered Little Mermaid. Yes. So there's a naked guy. I'm gonna call him David. For some reason. No, I should call him Cosimo. Yeah, but they say I'm naked all the time, but come on. Have you ever seen me naked? <laughs> but why is David in Copenhagen? It's in Florence usually. I don't know. He needed a change of scenery. Yeah. Uh, he's a little rusty. He is. I guess the weather is not as good here. Wow, who knows how much he has to pee? Pause. Wait, do you have to blur out that part? Let me just... Uh, there we go, now he's not naked. <laughs> So as you go towards the mermaid, there's a few different sculptures uh -huh. and we're going to start with the first one which is the Zinc Global, which is a, a sculpture made out of old machine parts and it's meant to be the first of a series. What's he doing on this part of the bench? He's just sitting down. It's a sculpture is believed to be the uh, key to the future. He's a visionary sitting on the key of the future. Mm. It's a key? Oh, it's a yeah, key? Yeah, it is a key. Oh, <laughs> Do you think he's gonna get up? Oh no, he's alive! Ah! <laughs> Cosimo was trying to fall in the water. Like, and the picture will be like this. No, oh, Coming up to a Little Mermaid, and of course there's like a billion people to see the Little Mermaid. Under the sea, no. <laughs> Darling, it's better. Brown where it's better. Take it from me. Naturally. You like you lost your head three times in a row, lady. No, that's not. Da, 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 that's da, the da, other da, mermaid. Da, 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 da. These are all of the people that like come to see the little mermaid. Side. They're all posing with them. Because a genetic one, guys. Don't be like all these normal people. <laughs> <laughs> crazy there was way too crowd, many people. people yes so did you know that the little mermaid is the symbol of Copenhagen Ooh. because the author of the story was from here and did you know that that's not her original head oh that's yeah creepy. in the 1964 they took it off some vandals Wait, how I, I guess they broke it off <laughs> okay so then eventually they made a new one a new eventually. head yeah, at one point. But then they decided to break off her arm, which they then recovered. But let's say they're not treating her very well. Yay. So now we're, now we're going to go see another statue, which is kind of another mermaid. Let's put it that way. Hopefully not everybody's going to go see that one too. This is officially dubbed by me, the genetically modified mermaid's friends. Oh, look, there's the genetically modified mermaid. Right in front of her genetically modified Wow, these are ugly, genetically modified friends. They don't, you don't know they have ears. They what? Well, because they're genetically modified. I mean, that one doesn't look like he has any ears. Look at this one, he's like, Hi. That's probably the husband of the genetically modified mer mer mermaid. And behold, the moment you've been waiting for. The genetically modified mermaid! What's wrong with that? Are those elf feet or something? Uh, this is a little creepy. She's just floating on a little island. Oh my gosh, you're right. If those rocks don't reach the bottom. Or do they? Does it look like it? We'll never know. Go uh, in! This is the genetically modified mermaid. You can see why. So basically, she was made 100 years after the first mermaid. and By a different By a different artist. person. So they say that she's the more modern one now. But also, she's now safe from vandalism because there's nothing to really fix. change. <laughs> fix and stuff. Yeah. And there's nobody here for this one. Exactly. I don't know why. It's so cool. Yeah. No, you know why? These are her genetically. Because they can't go touch her because she's living on her own little island. That's true. That was a smart but guys, move. Look how creepy. The island is just floating by itself. <laughs> there's no rocks under. Maybe. Done. Mama jumped out. Come with me. No, guys, save me. Yeah. 
she's pulling me. He, you guys should subscribe right now before she pulls me in. Ah, ah. Or you can, ah, and he can go. Ah, okay, subscribe in three, ah, two, ah, one. Whoa. Oh, you guys saved me. Kind of wish. That was a good thing for that. Ah!